Power. Candy Heart, Power of Love. finished the brains challenge and we're about to jump into pride day something tells me it's going to be magnificent and this is what we get we got the trinket we got what do we got rainbow worm as well as rainbow baby and three dollar bill going straight to it lives which is not that bad honestly but can we drop the trinket that's my question can we drop the trinket careful we just rock them by the way Cause I don't like Rainbow Worm. I think Rainbow Worm is one of it's one of the most interesting worms. But like having that weird shot, it's it's kind of awkward. Oh, got a little bit of lag. Careful. But I do like the fact that we have three dollar bill, which is pretty cool. I like three dollar bill. Careful. Going to it lives shouldn't be that difficult, honestly. I mean, it's for good practice. We should rush to the mom's foot another twenty minutes that way. You know, it's just better overall. Let's see what we get in the shop. It's a free open door anyway. I if I had enough money to buy that soul heart, I think I would go ahead and buy that. Secret room probably here, probably not. Oh wow, how lucky was that? Uh, I'm gonna blow you up to see if you could go ahead and give me a nickel. You did not give me anything. And I wouldn't mind going to the curse room, but I did pick up soul heart. So that's kind of an L on my end. I probably should have waited. Drop a bomb there. There we go. Pop this open. Oh, squeezy tears up. More soul hearts. We should probably now could go into the, the curse room. Now that we have at least a little bit of coverage and a safety blanket, you know, a little security when it comes to our HP. I mean, we're only going to it lives. Like the only difficult part is just getting there, right? Pick up the bomb. Let's continue moving up. Uh, do we care for that? Probably not. I think for famine, definitely not what you want to see. We want to see a regular boss to go ahead and build up our stats. So whenever you see a horseman early in the game, it's kind of difficult to deal with. Careful. Positive note, we do have Rainbow Baby. Rainbow Baby is not that great. It's pretty much just a familiar with $3 bill, but it's an extra DPS. And, you know, I can't say no to a little bit of more help when it comes to taking out these enemies faster. Ooh, Did I really just walk into that? Careful. Perfect. All right, pick up all the bandages and got to lick them all. Sure, let's just keep it moving. Again, we want to make it a good practice just to rush two mobs foot in under 20 minutes. Next big question, Angel Deal, Devil Deal. Um, we got really lucky in the last Angel Deal. We got Sacred Heart on the last challenge. Um, am I that lucky? Probably not. We do have a decent amount of soul hearts. We could probably try to go for, you know, we got enough keys to let's go see what's in the shop. We should probably go ahead and try Devil Deal. Devil deals are not that bad. They do help increase your damage. And they got a lot of cool stuff like Maul of the Void, Brimstone, obviously. The possibility of getting Guppy is huge, uh, but you do need three pieces for it. I just think having $3 bill is so fun and very, very interesting. If we could find Almond Milk somehow, I doubt it. It would make it a little bit more interesting. Big rooms like this is going to be a challenge, especially if you're trying to speedrun these, uh, these little obstacles, right? These little challenges. The pride challenge pride day challenge i mean we do got ball advantages we could use it you know just to it's pretty strong i know mean, back in the day we were able to use this this was a little bit slower since it spins a little faster now you're able to just go against enemies with ball advantages like this one for example or just get hit bad example let's go straight to our boss what do we get i think for baby plum do i have bombs i do i like baby plum baby plum duke of flies all of them are very very squishy like that, look at that. We're down to what? Under 50% of HP already. Careful. Down goes baby plum. Give me a little bit of glass eye damage and luck up. And you know what? Let's go double deal. Is it worth it? Nope. Scary. What was that? Scary face? Scary? Something like that. And um, I forgot the other one. But no, if it wasn't a guppy piece, I wasn't really going to do it. When you go devil deal, then you're about to waste your HP. You have to go for items that are really going to benefit the run. Something like that is not that great. Oh, a little bit of lag again. Careful. Oh, we almost got body there. All right. Let's keep it moving. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Don't delay the run. Half a soul heart is not that great. So I'm kind of happy we didn't waste any red hearts for a devil deal. 
Duh, that was way too close for comfort. Again, we could use the ball of bandages if we feel confident enough. I just don't feel as confident. Look at that. Uh, let's, let's see. If it's red chest, let's do it. If it's a regular chest, absolutely not. Now, I don't know if you noticed, but our stats are fluctuating back and forth. And that is because of the $3 bill. Or is that... Oh, wow. That's what I get for having one speed, right? Careful. Uh, we don't have enough money to really entertain the shop, so I don't think we should waste our keys, to be quite honest with you. So let's just go. And we have 16.9% deal with Angel. Careful, careful. We're looking for a tinted rock in here. Is there a tinted rock in here? No, but a stone chest that we can't reach, so we got to ignore it for now. Careful. Watch out for these little, little, uh, little guys coming up from the ground. They'll catch you off guard if you're not paying attention. Look at all this money. Ooh, luck up. I'm a big fan of luck, by the way. Luck is such an underrated stat line, especially with these gimmicky type tier effects. It works wonders. All right, we do have... Careful. I'm not a fan of these guys, but as long as we keep our distance... Wow, what a hit. That was a fast shot, though. That was a fast shot. Isaac for sustain. We should be okay. Do we have any bombs? No, so we can't knock them with the bomb. Careful with this. But again, the good thing about this whole entire thing... Careful. If we do have rainbow baby so ooh, too close so it's definitely gonna help with our dps and we kind of need that right now since we're not gonna get any crazy stats we got a nice glass eye increase the damage just a little bit but again because of three dollar bill like our tier rate is always good our tier effect is always gonna change and our stats are always gonna fluctuate oh look at this shot yep that was a big hit that was a big hit but we get hp out of it and look much needed speed ball speed and shot speed up having a high tier rate and a shot speed with three dollar bill is very very fun it's very fun all right that's what i need a tinted rock with no bombs that's what you want to see oh we almost got a rock there oh but we did get hit so we lost our angel little devil deal it's kind of our fault for trying to rush but with the fact that we can't really control our tears and or pick up any other trinket might be a little difficult I mean, look at our tier shot. It's all over the place. And we could kind of depend on Rainbow Baby. Probably it's just a little bit. Since it looks like Rainbow Baby is the only one that's really shooting straight. While we are not. Careful. Blow him up. Pop up. Just pop up a little bit. Boom. Let me get rid of you. Careful. 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 Are we able to get an angel deal or double deal that's worth it this run? I mean, a part of me says I should have won angel deal. But, you know, it is what it is. Speed's at 1.6. Well, now it's 1.3. That's what I get for not looking. Careful. Uh, Might as well check it. We got the money for it. If there was a luck up penny, I would sacrifice some HP for it. Secret room's probably above here. Probably. I don't have any bombs. If I did, I would waste it on the tinted rock. You gotta, you gotta make sure you use everything you got for a run like this. We have the speed. We should be able to be okay here. Careful. Or just get hit. There's our bomb. Okay, so we need to go back. And now we can waste a bomb here in hopes that we're gonna get another bomb. No, we get that in the key. So was it an L? Yes. But we have enough keys so we can check out what's in here. Dream capture is exactly what we need. If there's a way to get it. If there's a way to get Dreamcatcher, that's going to help our HP somewhat in a way survivability. It will give us a half a soul heart upon entering a new floor, but also it can let us know what's our boss fight and what's going to be in our treasure room, but we don't have any treasure rooms. So let's go ahead and buy Dreamcatcher. Right? Boom. Dreamcatcher, sweet dream. So it's going to give us half a soul heart. So if we don't get hit on the next floor, we should be okay. But we definitely need a bomb. Because we still got that tinted rock we want to pop open. Back to max HP is what we want to see. Chill here. He slowed down. Careful. Oh yeah, our shot's not hitting him. I don't know if you noticed that. We can use ball of bandages if we need to. I kind of don't want to. Because it's so slow. And those enemies are just a little too fast. Alright, we got our bomb. Let's go back straight into that tinted rock. Pop it. Go ahead and get that. Hopefully he drops a soul heart or small rock. I'll take small rock. 
because we know we're going to get a half a soul heart on the next floor because of Dreamcatcher. So we know that's going to happen. Oh, did not want to go into this room. That was a misplay. Careful. Just want to blow these up. There we go. And blow that up. Boom. The room is done. Okay, let's go back down here. And there's a tinted rock. Oh, wow. What a L. I mean, at least we get a bomb, so we can kind of use it against the boss. Hopefully, it's a very squishy. Hopefully, it's Duke of Flies. I don't think it will be. But if it's Duke of Flies, we should get a W out of that. Because Duke of Flies is like baby plum. You know, very, very squishy. You can pop a bomb. Probably take about 75%. 50 to 75% of the HP. But we get Gertie. Big old Gertie. Now, which one is it? That's the question. I think it's the one that's going to spawn enemies constantly. If it shoots, eh, we should be okay with our speed. I mean, look how much HP we're just... We're just melting him. Careful. We just melted Gertie. That was a good fight. Good fight. And look at that. Screw gets nice tears and shot speed. And this is the thing I'm talking about Dreamcatcher. Ready? We're going to enter this, and this little dream world is going to let us know we're fighting the cage. And obviously, we get no treasure room. So we know we're fighting the cage, and there's our, our, there's our half heart, which is perfect for us. Okay. I think we're making decent timing to go ahead and get to the boss rush under bomb's foot under 20 minutes. Careful. The shot needs to be straight. All right, what do you got for me? More bombs. I'm okay with that, especially against cage. We could slow him down and go ahead and pop him. This will slow us down. If we're not careful pop this guy here at least we have a decent shot speed at 1.4 that's not that bad push this back that's what you want to see blow him up and it's again three dollar bill it's somewhat dangerous but it has you know it has its moments where it's kind of beneficial as you just saw there careful we didn't get any great items i mean hopefully we can get a devil deal and kind of make this run a little bit more simpler just help us out just a tad a bit we just need to find some soul hearts or luck up a uh, penny now we're at three again you kind of want a high luck that way your tier your gimmicky tier effects are popping a little bit more isaac versus envy is not what you want to see especially if you're trying to speed run the challenge to be quite honest with you stuff like this is just prolongs the run enemies that escape the field of vision enemies that spawn enemies it's just the add-ons are just annoying especially if you're not like used to uh, the room being extremely overwhelming or overran by a whole bunch of little tiny enemies it can get annoying but you know what shoot the whoop was worth it take the pill we got enough luck or oh, shot speed down all right but shoot the whoop is good man shoot the whoop is good check this out we're gonna just boom one shot him and again another room where you have a boss that's gonna drop add-ons thankfully we shoot the whoop the first wave shoot the whoop is great if you could find a way to get the battery so it's a one room charge Careful. Whoa, holy shot. Didn't think we had that in us. Careful. We got decent damage. We're sitting at over four. Tier rates over four uh, when it pops. Uh, No bombs. We actually do have a bomb. We can go ahead and make a bridge here, I believe. Yes, we did. Okay. Because uh, we get our bomb back anyway, but at the same time, we're getting a consumable. So, boom. There we go. Why am I, like, glowing? That's interesting. Okay, got it careful don't get stuck it's okay stop shooting it's all right to stop shooting to go ahead and reposition yourself because we didn't want to get popped by that bomb let's take another penny let's keep going there's our store i do have eight cents and the bible is a one shot against mom we actually have to switch and pivot we're gonna holy bible and one shot at uh mom's foot as well as it lives and we kind of need hp so we're gonna go ahead and grab that Again, we want to get this because we, we are planning on taking the devil deal. Careful. And I want to make sure that I have enough HP to survive a little bit longer. Even though we are going to one-shot mom's foot and we are going to one-shot... Oh, there's a center rock there. We are going to one-shot it lives. So the run pretty much is... Is it a GG? Let's just be honest here. Is it a GG? I don't know. I'm going to say yes because... Of, oh, careful. We don't lose this devil deal. I got, a little, I got a little too reckless on that one. This is an interesting room, though, if you think about it. You don't see rooms this, like this. Where a whole bunch of stuff are flying around. Little enemies are all over the place, so especially we're going to get hit like that. So we lost our eternal heart. We didn't lose our devil deal, though. So let's go back and pop this tinted rock in hopes that there is a soul heart. We didn't get lucky in the last one. There is. There's two. Okay. So we should take a devil deal, and we should get a devil deal. 
Just gotta find our boss wherever he is. Um, I got three bombs. I really don't want to waste my time. Oh, how lucky are we? Yes, this is a good one. Let's just really not get hit by any flames. I almost got hit by a flame. Careful. Push that there. Blow that up. Golden bomb is a GG for the boss, which is good. Okay, and that. You know what? We got golden bomb. Just let's wrap this up. Make it a little bit faster. Wheel of Fortune is interesting. And pick up this key. Okay, so I think we wasted a little bit too much time. Put the golden bomb there. We just want to utilize everything we got as quickly as we can. Now that we got golden bomb, even though it's just for the floor, we can at least wrap it up a little bit faster. And we might as well pop the Bible to get a little bit of uh, flight so we can hide over here. Careful. He's going to run around. It's okay. Again, we have golden bomb. We should utilize that. If we could just aim it correctly, we want to hide amongst these little blades. The spiked rocks because he can't get over there he, he cannot get over there there we go down goes the cage give me that sty damage and range up but let's see what kind of devil deal we get it's a devil is devil deal but we at least get some black hearts out of it so it wasn't a complete waste and hp is going to be fine we got the bible so we're going to be okay against mom's foot as well as it lives the biggest challenge is getting there how are we on time we're at 14 minutes in so we have to look for our full car so let's go with the x on it and then we should be fine mind you we don't have golden bombs here so oh i, I see a tinted rock though so let's pop this get some more hopefully it's so hard so it's not that's an interesting a tinted rock that dropped off stone chest what the that's mediocre all right we gotta look for a skull with this x on it careful with these guys oh that's what i'm saying be careful with those guys that came out of nowhere. That was like a... What a shot, by the way. All right, we should be okay. Let's just keep it moving. We gotta move a little bit faster. Gotta move a little bit faster. I don't think we're doing... Honestly, I don't even think we're playing that well. Usually, we're pretty spot on with our positioning, but we're definitely not. We're definitely not spot on right now. Get it. Always get remove these guys as quickly as you can. Enemies that escape the field of vision, they're the worst. Any tinted rocks? No. Yeah, okay. Let's go work our way up. We should be able to take this guy out pretty fast. Especially even with Rainbow Baby and the $3 bill. And Rainbow Worm. I hate Rainbow Worm. Such a horrible trinket. Horrible, horrible trinket. Especially with shots like this. Look, we're not even like directing the shot. Careful. Give me something good. Thank you. Skull with the X on it. There it is. Skull with the X on it. Give me my full card. We got 24 cents. Um, Not worth it. Absolutely not worth it. But I will buy a Soul Heart. And I'm actually going to pop you in hopes of getting, I might as well buy it, bomb. In hopes of getting another devil deal. Now we got to find our mom's foot fight. Ooh, watch the brimstone. I saw you this time. Yeesh. We're not taking him out fast enough. Thankfully we did. Okay, let's go move up. This is prolonging everything. Thankfully it's just a one tap for our mom's foot. Oh man. That was rough. Oh, uh, we get a bomb. Take the bomb. Take the bomb and go. Seven bombs are going to be good. A room like this is disgusting. If we could just blow up everything. Oh my god, that bomb did absolutely nothing. Well, we might as well finish the room. Eye of Belial. Beautiful. You know what? If the Devil Deal can give me Eye of Belial, I think it'd be, it'd be a little bit easier to handle. We still got three red hearts, so that's not too bad. Three red hearts, two and a half soul heart protection. Careful with the brimstone and the creep on the ground. Nice try, sir. Nice try. Screw it. Give me. Hey, I can see forever. Let's go. Holy Bible. One shot. Thank you. Give me this. Mom's heal. No devil to angel deal. But we do get the boss rush. Uh, We could get the virus or candy heart. Power of love. So now whatever. Oh, nice. Secret room. I believe whenever we go into a pick up a red heart, I think we get stats. I could be wrong though. Another luck up. Four luck is amazing. I think we get stats whenever we do pick up a red heart. Obviously, we can't. Unless we find an arcade and manipulate our HP. There's an arcade. <laughs> so we're going to manipulate our HP in hopes of getting stats. Come on, get rid of this guy. Pop him. 
Obviously, it's going to prolong the run, but I kind of want to test this theory out. I want to see what happens with Candy Heart. And we might get an item out of this. Shot speed down is not what we want. What you got? Ooh. Empty Heart. It multiplies. So let me see. All right, so we do get stats up whenever we pick up a Red Heart. But I'm going to try to get Empty Heart popping. So let's go into the next floor and see what happens. Pick that up. Hey, yeah, we do get stats up every time we pick up a Red Heart with Candy Heart. So, hey, man. We could probably make something happen with this. And I'm down. Let's actually get rid of the shot speed down. Because I know in me, I'm probably going to pop it really quickly by accident. Can we go into it? No, we can't go into the boss rush. We got Wheel of Fortune. And what was this again? I can see forever. Uh, let's pop it on the next floor. It could be useful. And I want to see what Empty Heart can do. We could look for a super secret room. It's right there. Thank you. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's what we want. We want stat building. And we are going to go back because we don't have a lot going for ourselves in this run. Let's go back into the arcade and empty our HP out. It's going to be a little bit of back and forth and it seems like a waste of time. But it looks like we have to do this right now. We have to be able to build our stats up by some way. Somehow. And we do have Empty Heart. I'm not really familiar with what Empty Heart's going to do. I, I, I have a feeling it might give us a soul heart or an eternal heart which is fire or it might give us a uh, complete empty heart container which is insane all right let's go just continue on with the run i think we have enough again with the holy bibles will protect us but oh i didn't want to pick that up whatever but upon entering the womb and beyond every time we take a hit it's kind of dangerous yeah we do get an empty heart container perfect i can see forever let's pop this immediately and just get to town start getting to work we're building our stats by Candy Heart. That's the way we're doing this. All right, let's go. I mean, our damage, I don't know if we saw, but our tier rate's over four at one point. Careful. All right, let's get rid of you first. You seem annoying. Thank you. Big horn, little horn. Careful with this. Get rid of you. And our damage is sitting at over four as well. So it's not, I mean, it's not, not bad. It's not that bad. We just got to get there. The point is getting to the destination, and then we'll just pop the Bible for the GG. Uh, we can go down. We should absolutely play this out. What do you got for me? Trash. Wait, chill here in the corner. Again, we gotta build stats by picking this up. We're gonna do the same concept here. That's beautiful. PJs, you feel cozy. I And look at our HP, back to normal. Will I go into the curse room? Probably not. That was a big L, by the way. I got stuck there. We're not going into the curse room. We can't waste... Oof, we cannot waste HP chest in a chest what do you got for me high priestess that's a one shot on the boss which kind of helps us out we just got to get there can i escape no i can't okay first things first get rid of the guy next to, next to you and then go for this guy with our random shots and boom honestly not so bad of a challenge to be quite honest with you uh pop you because you could drop an item here or not that's what we want to see Look at that stats. Damage over 6.83. Tier rates over 4.23. And we're looking for our boss or dead end. Yep. Saw that happening. If we were able to pick up some more red hearts, that'd be great. We need another arcade or we need a blood donation machine. Because I really want to take advantage of our empty heart container. That's pretty sick. Careful. This is where Rainbow Baby comes in handy. And a three dollar bill because like my shots are have like a little curve to it another red heart we can't pick up and a dead end yikes uh, we don't really need money we're at 60 cents money equals power would be insane to find by the way just chill out with you look how long that took to get rid of them Ooh, i'm very surprised we didn't get hit there look at our shot get rid of the add-on oh that was way too close get rid of the add-on because that creep on the ground is going to just destroy us or we could just wait until he runs into us. That works too. You know what? Let's take some pills. Let's see what happens. Full health pill. One makes you smaller. Luck down. Range up. And puberty. Whole bunch of pills did absolutely nothing. If you take if you take three puberty pills, I mean you become an adult, which is cool. You get a whole red heart up. A little bit of benefits. Did I just walk into that creep? Uh oh. Juked him. Juked them. 
Ah, uh, got me. Come on, shot. I need my shot to get there. I think first Blastoise. Oh, there's two of them. Drop the high priestess. Hit somebody, please. Make their run. Make this fight a little bit easier. There's a lot of them. Random lost contact. What an interesting room. It was double the Blastoise. Careful. Honestly, we took care of that pretty well. And we're probably still gonna get a devil deal. Nope, never mind. Get mom's lipstick. And a whole bunch of red hearts we can't do anything about. Okay, we have four red heart containers. Obviously, the empty container is not gonna do anything, but we do get half a heart protection. And there's an arcade. If we're able to find some red hearts and if it's needed. Oh, careful. No, no need to go. Let's go left. We do have the Bible. Again, it should be a quick GG. Which is the whole point. Now the question is, would we have won without the Bible? Not even 100% sure. Alright, so dead end there. Looks like we have to go this way. Trinket we can't get. Um, secret is probably somewhere around here. There it is. That means we're going up. Let's just bomb our way up. Oh, why? <laughs> I think it was great, but look at that. Careful, they're gonna blow him up. We lost a half heart, but we get our bomb back. Alright, let's go this way. Let's continue going up north. Another boss room. Let's drop the bomb. There we have plenty of them. Just to speed that up a little bit. Boom. Okay. We just want to speed it up. But you got two diamonds. Why not? We're at 99 cents and we're at a dead end. Let's just wrap around these guys. Our shots are all over the place. Careful. That's one, two. Take a bomb since we just wasted it. Ran into another dead end. Now we can take a hit. There are some red hearts that dropped. To build some stats but again in the woman beyond you really really have to be careful man every hit you take is like fighting a boss or fighting a challenge room like it's it's, it's kind of devastating tears down is not what you want to see they didn't want to do that but why not get some more bombs for flavor we completely careful ran into so many dead ends like that's just devastating and we're doing this again is it worth it probably not but there are some red hearts we have eight bombs. I mean, we could use one bomb there. Boom. Make it a little bit easier. I want to go back and pick up those red hearts. I want to make sure I get to the fight with max HP. And that's a soul heart. So that is beneficial as well. I just want to make sure I have enough stats before. We don't really need money. We're at 99 cents. All right. So where are we on stats? I mean, I wish we could see how much candy heart really, how much it benefited us in the run. Because it's a great, don't get me wrong, it's a really good item. I don't, I just don't see it off. You actually don't see it at all. I think the last time I saw it was probably in an angel deal. Such a long time ago. Two of spades, why not? We got 24 keys, you know, just, just get the, can I shot hit there? Can I shot hit the target? There you go. Interesting. Uh, we will not be going to the crystal room. We could play you out. You could drop a red heart. Is it needed? Probably not. Whoa, what a shot. Good shot on you, friend. Good shot on you. You got me there. Uh, super secret room probably here. Oh, we're probably not. Super secret room's here. Let's go. What you got for me? A battery is not needed. Okay, so we made it to our final destination. Honestly, this, this run took a weird, weird toll. We played pretty sloppy. Let's see what's got in our devil deal. And Maul of the Void, as well as Dark Matter. You both came a little too late. But there goes this challenge, Pride Day. If you like what you see, check out the channel. I appreciate everybody watching. Until next time.